Hi, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 3rd, 4th, 5th, 6th maybe, next couple of days, energy. Let's see, let's see what we have today. Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Uh, looks like she's focused. She's really focused on stability, security, something solid, real. This is a worker, okay? This is the queen of work, the queen of stability, security. Uh, she may do uh, work with money, work with uh, banks. This could be a mother, uh, somebody that's very focused, loyal, devoted. Whatever she is doing, she is focused on stability, okay? Uh, she has an opportunity in her lap that's a golden opportunity. Uh, she knows her value. She knows her worth. She has a lot to offer, okay? Her focus is on what she can hold on to, what she can obtain. She can turn anything into a profit. She has skills. This is somebody has, uh, that has already uh, learned a lot of skills. She's already done a lot of work. Now she's in a really good position where people may go to her for advice even. Okay? Whatever is happening, we have an individual that is very determined to have success, financial success, and is willing to do some sort of work and probably has the skills to do the work, put it that way. Looks like she's in a position of power. She's probably very confident in whatever she does. Definitely thinking about, you know, her stability, her security. Oh, we need to, oh my goodness gracious. Woo. Wow, so the Queen of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles, this is a couple, this is a pair. We may also have somebody that is leveling up. This may be one person that, you know, maybe they're balancing their feminine and their masculine, you know, energy as well, doing it quite well. But there is a couple, this is, this, or this is one person that is taking on, you know, both energies. Wow, this definitely has to do with long-term stability and building, you know, a foundation. The focus is long-term stability. That's all there is to it. I mean, that is the focus. This has to do with um, building a strong foundation, a uh, secure foundation. The interest is, you know... <laughs> financial stability put it that way that is the main interest definitely could be dealing with uh it's a groundedness but definitely could be dealing with an earth sign taurus virgo capricorn um the time is ripe it's definitely a very fertile time um this is about leadership, calling the shots, making decisions that are best for the long term. I mean, that's what this is. It 
could have to do with the business, the long-term security of the business. Now, this is all, this is about hard work. This is not about the looks of the situation. I mean, even though, you know, we need to have it stable and it needs to look good, but it needs to really, this is about real, okay? This is not about, you know, do you want something that looks good or do you want something that is good? You know, that's what this is. This is about reality. This is about, you know, it's not about, I mean, it's kind of like when you, this is about work, right? It's kind of like when you hire somebody to do a job, right? And they look really good, right? They look really good. But do they have the skills? Will their looks get the job done? There's definitely a decisive action being taken because the king of pentacles is somebody that makes decisions. So isn't the queen. These, there's decisive action being taken. This definitely has to do with, you know, a partnership, I believe. It may have to do with work. This has to do with getting the job done. You know, you want to get the job done. You got to, you got to have somebody who wants, who is very focused you know, if you're going to do the job, you're going to do the job. It's, that's a fact. Anyhow, five of cups and the four of swords reversed. So there's sadness. And we have exhaustion. We have somebody here that is exhausted. They're tired. They're fed up. There's, there's been some sort of loss. Maybe it's a financial loss. It could be an emotional loss. Maybe there's been a separation. There's been a timeout. There's been... Maybe somebody's been taking a break of some sort. I feel like the stagnation period is over, okay? It almost feels like somebody's been healing from something. Maybe they experienced a loss. And anyhow, time's up with the Four of Swords reversed. This is the, the waiting period is over. The laying there, being exhausted and fed up with the loss. It's like you can't, you got to do something about it. You can't just lay there and pray that things get better. You know, you got to do the work. You got to put in effort. You got to be focused. There's something about maturing as well. Something is maturing These are so stiff. Hero font reverse. We may have somebody here that's been having a hard time doing the right thing. This may be somebody that has been in a position of authority that has abused their position. There may be some sort of disgrace, breaking rules, social pressure. Somebody's been under social pressure. It's been causing them to maybe listen to poor counsel as well. There could be religious factors in the way. There could be somebody that struggles with I want to say faith or commitment or social pressure. There is a disgrace here. There's also somebody here that, well, has been, I want to say breaking the rules, not listening, not able to listen to any guidance or listening to poor guidance.
Eight of Cups reverse. Eight of Cups reverse. Now there could be something that is coming back around. Somebody could be going back to something or they're taking a long time to think about their next steps. Long-term security, long-term stability is the main focus here. But we do have somebody here that is really struggling with doing the right thing. And maybe it's because of beliefs. It could be because of stubbornness as well. Death, the end. Death is a transformation. It's a transition. It's the end of things. Like I said, it's the end of a waiting period. And I think we talked about this yesterday. Maybe somebody had to learn some sort of lesson. Hmm. Death is a change. Somebody's been staying put in a situation. There could be, you know, there's, there could be a relationship that is not on the same page. We have an individual or individuals that just don't see eye to eye. Somebody's thinking about leaving. They may also be thinking about going back to something. We definitely have an overwhelmed energy. We have a hard worker here. We do have somebody here that is a very hard worker. This is somebody that has come a long, long way. And they've been holding on to something that is uh, extremely overwhelming. This, this, is, this is very overwhelming. You know, this is a heavy load. I wonder if there's some sort of obligation. Somebody feels obligated. There's some sort of obligation. Anyhow, we have the end of this burden, this difficult situation. This is the end of the road. It is the end of the road. Somebody's been facing a lot of challenges, and it may have to do with beliefs or poor counsel or social pressure and there's a build up here this is pressure this is build up it is build up there could be a collapse and i don't know if it's a collapse of an empire or something like that i feel like we have somebody here that is really struggling with i don't know i feel like it's beliefs or burdens baggage responsibilities I feel like we have somebody here that has tried really, 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 really hard. They've tried really hard to do something and it's over. It's actually over. This, this phase is over. It's over. It's over. It's over. Somebody has been working really, really hard. They haven't been... listening or they've been listening to poor counsel about a situation there it feels like there's a relationship that that is not on the same page and i don't know if this is between work colleagues or it's between a partnership a marriage there could be the end of a marriage the end of a commitment uh, just saying, the end of a marriage, the end of a commitment. May, there may even have something to do with a corporation here. Or government, you know? Something to do with the government. There's social pressure here. There's definitely heavy pressure. This is under pressure. We have somebody here that is under pressure. But we go back to that Four of Swords reverse. That is... Uh, exhausted fed up this is too much it's too much there's a need to get up there's a need to do something there's a need to get to work put it that way and you need to make choices 
not based on social pressure, okay? Whatever that means to you. Temperance reverse, something is off. There's a need to reevaluate. There's a uh, resisting, going against the flow. Very frustrated. Somebody's frustrated. They're, they, they're struggling. This is some sort of struggle, repeating negative patterns, inappropriate behavior, going to extremes. Somebody's going to extremes. They may be extremely unhealthy. This is lack of management. It could be mismanagement. Not managing things well. Somebody needs to manage things. There's, it's like going against the flow, right? Going against... Not compromising. There's a lack of compromise. There's a lack of... Ease, this forcefulness here. It feels like somebody's trying to force something and it's uh, causing disharmony. There's an imbalance here. There could even be some addictions that are in the way. There's a lack of evolution. There's a need to evolve. There's a need to accept when things are over, when phases are over, when it's time for a change. Oh, my goodness gracious. The Page of Wands is good news. If there could be a message coming, this message could be... Uh, exciting. This could be a new direction. We have somebody here that is in a situation that is, it's not easy, okay? And it's, there's, there's some sort of strong resistance here. There's, so, there's a need for change, right? There's a need to take action. There's a need to go in a new direction. There's a need to not resist it, but hmm. there's impatience here as well frustration somebody's very frustrated there's a lot of this is very heavy it's very heavy there's a lot of demands a lot of um trying hard to hold on to something that is too heavy it's too much it's too much there there is some sort of message that is coming You must struggle through this. You must be open-minded. You must look at things from a new perspective. But I feel like we have somebody, and a, wait, a waiting period is over. Somebody's been uh, holding on. They've been reviewing. They feel like there's also some sort of punishment as well. It's almost like trying to punish somebody. That is wasted time. It really is. It's just it's childish behavior. It really is. It's inappropriate behavior. Wasting your time trying to punish somebody when you could be building long-term security and focusing on your business and doing the work that you need to do and not letting social media or social pressure get in the way. You know, you need to refocus. Somebody here needs to refocus. They need to stop trying to prove themselves and look at, you know, life in a completely different manner, okay? But whatever. There's a lot of children out there or people that are not matured that their main focus is other people and outside appearances. And that's not healthy. And there is something here that's not healthy. But anyhow, um, the hangman reversed. Missing an opportunity will not change. Extremely stubborn. There is somebody here that is going to extremes. They're extremely stubborn. They are resisting. But change is coming, like it or not. I would say that you don't have a choice, really. I mean, change is right in the middle. I mean, this is the death of a situation, person, or idea. It is time for a change. It's time to get some help. Or it's time to accept. It's time to go in a new direction. It's time to... Uh, maybe take some sort of risk. The 
This does definitely have to do with financial st stability, long-term stability. The Nine of Pentacles is an independently owned and operated individual who has done a lot of work. This may be uh, self-work. It could be, you know, work, work, whatever it is. This is an individual that has already learned a lot of skills, okay, and now has the opportunity to just, I want to say, use those skills, maybe relax a little bit. This is somebody that, you know, has already done a lot of work and has the skills, has the reward. There could be a reward here for a job well done as well. Something is being seen about somebody's work, some, and maybe it wasn't seen in the past. We may have a new vision. We may have a new outlook. There's been, I feel like things are about to change. Something is being seen about a situation where something is off. Okay, this is, this is lack of profound self-healing is needed. But temperance reversed. Somebody needs to heal. They need to... Uh, accept something, you know, there's something about acceptance. This is a lack of acceptance. It's, it's trying to push, trying to force, resisting. It's going against the flow. It's, you know, it's, this is a lack of comp compromise. It's mismanagement. It's a lack of management. Um, there's too much force. There's too much... push and pull, you know, it's not a good mix, it's not a good match, you know, forcing things doesn't work out, because it's a big mess. It's kind of like trying to force that puzzle piece into the puzzle and it doesn't go in that spot. You know what I mean? It's like you got you're doing this big old puzzle, right? And you have the pieces out, and you, this piece looks like it's gonna fit. <laughs> We're going back to the beginning now, huh? This piece looks like it's gonna fit. Looks good. It's like, oh, this one fits. No, it doesn't fit. You gotta have the right piece. If you don't, and for and. Otherwise, the whole thing is gonna be off, and it's gonna look like shit, right? And it's just. It's not going to be right. Okay, you've got to have the right piece. It's not, it may have looked like it was going to fit, but if it doesn't fit, it doesn't fit. you got to have the exact right piece to have the, the, the alignment that you need, right? But people don't, they don't look. It's like, oh, this is going to fit. It's the easiest route, right? It looks, looks good, but it doesn't really fit. Something is off, right? Even if it's a little tiny bit, something is off. And if you, if you make decisions on the fly without, you know, being patient, then you're really going to get yourself in trouble. But we won't go down that path right now. You know, you got to think things through about long-term stability, about alignment, about, you know, if you want to get it right, if you want to get the job done right, sometimes you have to listen to your own gut and maybe go against society, right? Anyhow, we do have a change here. We have a new vision. We have a new adventure. We have a new direction. This may not be easy, okay? This may be an, not an easy transition. It might not be easy, okay? Somebody could also be going back to something. This could be a sudden situation with the Page of Wands. That can be very sudden. Um, we may have a sudden change. Somebody may be changing their mind about something, um, they've been really trying to hold on to something that 
a relationship that isn't on the same page, whether this is a work relationship or it's a belief or something like that. So anyway, I also feel, where are we at, 1140? Um, I also feel that, you know, Well, we have somebody that is really struggling with this change, but, you know, you have to accept reality of the situation, you know, but that's what the message is. Everything changes, seeing that, you know, it's time. The timing has been off. Maybe the timing was off. Somebody's going back to something. Maybe they needed to learn a lesson. The king man is about learning a lesson about themselves. Maybe they, they had to work on themselves. Maybe they had to do self-work. Maybe they had to go through a phase of, you know, re-identification, you know. Um, everything changes. And I would say that you, you may not be aware that a change is coming, but this is a change. And it is a big one. It is a very, very, very big one. Okay, um, there is something that is off here. I also feel for some that somebody is doing something. They may be trying to punish somebody. Um, it's childish, immature behavior, you know, um, because they can't manage their feelings. Somebody may be trying to punish somebody. They're jealous. They may be jealous of their status, jealous of their independence, jealous, jealous of their work. Somebody may be trying to punish somebody. Um, so that's here as well. Oh, let's get one of these. What do we have? What does the fool have to say? Maybe somebody hadn't learned a lesson, huh? The fool's tax. This has to do with this person is paying their taxes. The fool's wisdom. Live and learn. Pay up. Live and learn. This is definitely about living and learning. It definitely has to do with living and learning. Somebody has been holding on to something that is weighing them down and they're under a lot of pressure. A lot of pressure. It's time to go in a new direction. If you, if you want stability, you have to refocus, okay? You have to refocus. And it's, it's not... It's not easy, okay? It's not easy. You can't be lazy, and I'm and I'm sorry to say that. You ha there's work involved here. You have to do the work. You you have to do the work, and you have to make choices that aren't pretty. Good luck. 